It's the most awkward thing ever trying to find like a good position to record a video inside of a car. Um, why am I in a car? It's because I'm just waiting for some, some people at the moment and I'm not even the one driving, but look, here I am by the way. Anyway, um, distractions. So we've got another question from Slink. This one comes through Instagram. Slink is a active member of the community, especially in our Discord server, and they have contributed to a few different projects, specifically the Biogen add-on and as of today, the community material pack. Although it won't be today when this video goes out, but you know, you, you get the point. The, the question is, what made you use Blender as opposed to other softwares like Cinema 4D, other than the fact that Blender is free? If you're wondering what the mark on my nose is, that's from the sunglasses. Anyway, yeah, so I mean, of course, one of the main reasons is that Blender is free, but I think it goes well beyond that because Blender is more than just a software. Blender's community, more than anything, is I think one of the main selling points and reasons for using it in the same way the, the Unity engine is empowered quite strongly by its community as well. Basically, if you encounter a problem, more than likely someone else has already had the same problem and has shared it online and has received help for it. That's something that you don't typically see with super high paid softwares. Again, it depends, depends on the problem, depends on the community. The size of the Blender audience also allows for other things to happen, so for example, the YouTube channel because there are so many people in the community it means there are so many people that can become audience members and likewise can become customers for whatever business ideas that you have. So basically there's just more to work with but another aspect of it is that Blender is so extensible much more so than other softwares and that means that it's easy to build tools for your own workflows and again because of the community and because it's free it means it's also easy to share those tools with other community members and even to receive funds for it. But of course it being free and open source is one of the main selling points Although Blender still stands out a bit because there are so many open source projects online which are just kind of dead, like open source software projects. So Blender really stands out because it has so much funding. I think that's because there's a really high demand for 3D creation suites around the world. It just kind of bleeds into all different kinds of industries, not just game development and VFX, but architectural visualization, fashion, product design, storyboarding, therapy, all sorts of stuff. Like it's such a fundamental thing, it's hard to kind of pin down all of the use cases for it. So I think Blender's in quite a unique position. And I think year by year now, it is starting to take over other higher paid softwares, like across various industries. So there are lots of different reasons why, you know, a to use Blender but I think yeah the accessibility of it being free is the main one however like it's not the first 3D software I ever used I used 3D Studio Max back in the day because my dad had a copy of that I think it was around like 2004 2005 that time I think the first time I touched Blender was probably 2006 ish 7 8 I'm not too sure. I think it was something to do with converting models for the Elder Scrolls for Oblivion to like a certain file format. I think like I had to use Blender with a certain plugin. I can't exactly remember. It was quite a while ago now. But anyway, yeah, hopefully that answers the question. But if it doesn't, then the answer you're looking for is because Blender will one day take over them all with its extreme amount of funding and rapidly developing demand from an increasing audience of millions upon millions of people and all of the other software should be cowering in fear. Big things have small beginnings, as was demonstrated in the film Prometheus. All right. <laughs> um, so yeah, hopefully that answers the question. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time.